Hello friends, welcome. In this video I'm going to edit the community. We need to add the link here. Also I'm going to install the Slack package. Add edit link, edit the community and push the GitHub. I'm going to install this package. Eloquent sluggable. So let's uh, go down. Let's copy the command here. Go to the VS code and paste that in. Hit enter and next thing we need to add use sluggable and add this method to the uh, model. So let's copy that and close now the terminal. Open the community model and let's say use also, sorry use also sluggable okay and paste that method now the source is coming from the name here okay save this one and because we are here let's also add the same in the post so let's say right here sluggable and paste that method and here is coming from the title the source save close this one and now we don't need when we create we don't need this field sluggable because it's going to generate automatically automatically based on the name okay so let's uh, open the resources js pages community create page and let's remove the slug okay save this one and now we install the package we need to add the edit link so inside the index in the community communities index in the table we have this link here for the edit and instead of anchor tag we need to use the inertia link so let's say here a link like this and the shelf is going to be dynamic and paste here the road which is going to be communities dot uh, edit and we need to add here the community id yeah like this and let's remove this because it's auto completed and okay if i save and go to the browser go to the com communities go to this edit link right now we need we don't have that uh... so let's open the community controller okay and in the edit let's remove this one and say community dollar sign community and here we need to return the page so i'm going to save this create page as a edit page so let's save this as edit and now in the community controller here i'm going to say return inertia render or we can use this one but we going to use the this inertia render and say community communities slash edit and we need to add the compact we need to add the community here very good if i save 
go to this one and yeah but here we need now the name and description to be present here so In the edit view, what we can do here in the define probes, if I say here uh, community like this, it's going to be an object. Okay, that's it. Uh, it's coming from the community controller. We add it here and we accept it in the define props. It's okay. I want now to fill this name to be the same as the community here. And if I say right now, like this, it's not going to work. So let's say just to show you community dot name. If I save and come here and we have an error, inspect elements, and it's going to say uh, community is not defined. Okay, so if you go in to the Vue.js and define props and define emits, we can see the define props and define emits are compiler macros only use, usable inside the script setup. So we need to create some const props and use them as a prop here. So let's say if I say now const props like this, okay, and now instead of just community, I'm going to say props.community, props.community, if I save, go to the browser and refresh, now we have Laravel here, everything works correctly. And instead of this, let's uh, remove everything, say just props.community here, save, and now we have also the name and the description. Very good. Now, when we submit, we say form post, but we need to say form put. And the route is going to be communities update. Okay, and we need the params here. So let's say props dot community dot id. Okay, and I think we are okay now. If I save and let's see name laravel updated say store and we don't have nothing logic here in the update what we are going to update we are going to update only the name and the description and if i open the community store request also here we need to remove this one and we have the name and the description so that's it's okay we are going to use this community store request also in the update so instead of the default request i'm going to say community store request okay and here let's say instead of this id i'm going to say also community not comment dollar sign community and say here dollar sign community update the request validated if i save and also we need to return to the wrote uh, 
communities index like this save it come here and refresh again just in case and say Laravel updated like this say store we need to change that we can see is Laravel updated okay now let's uh, change this to be update so in the index edit sorry let's go to the form and we have store here let's say update click save refresh and we have update let's go back remove this click update okay now we added an edit link we edit the community let's push to the github come here cancel let's add git add here git commit uh, community updated and let's say git push and everything okay hope you enjoy friends and see you in the next one all the best